Hey guys, so I just wanted to show off what I've built to do the pull-up bar thing for my robot. So as you can see, this is the attachment itself. It's using pneumatics in order to do it. And all, all you have to do to just get on the robot, you just have to push it in a bit. Uh, this doesn't use the axle pins like I do for most attachments, just because uh, you have to pull it up. So push that in there. And yeah, but it still is pretty easy to mount onto. So I guess I'll just go over what exactly is going on here. So as I said, this is using a pneumatic system. And uh, I think the most notable feature are these four medium sized pneumatic pistons, which uh, when activated, uh, this air tank uh, pushes air into each one of these pistons, which lowers this onto the pull-up bar and carries the robot up. So I guess I'll just go over what the loop is. You have the pump here, which goes into the air tank here. You can see the blue tube. The pump then goes into this valve. So the thing about this valve is when it, uh, let me get it, it activates, it opens up once the robot hits the side of the pull-up bar. So that's when uh, the pump rushes air into the cylinders. And and then yeah, you have the cylinders and they're all lifting up these, uh, I don't know what it's like, these octagon elves, I don't, I'm not sure what the best word is, but they basically uh, lift these octagon L things up and it's all connected through one axle. So you can see this axle. It's all, all four are using the same axle to lift them up. And well, why don't we see this in action, how it works.